got some good work done. Um, finished with a four-minute, two-minute drill situation where the first defense had to go out there, and uh, if they gave up 10 yards, they lost the game. And uh, they did a good job. They made the offense go backwards, made them use all their timeouts. So it was really good game, real exercise. And we're trying, you know, we're, we're trying to segue from camp is over, you know, now we're into game mode, game week mode, and understanding the realism of, of what a football game is all about. Had a good practice. I uh, got to do some situational stuff. Uh, you know, we put our first team offense and first team defense on a team together today and simulated a four minute situation where we were trying to get the ball back as a defense. And then our first team offense went out there once we got the ball back and went down and tried to score a field goal to win the game. So it was great situational work. You know, a lot of times you run plays against each other, but you've got to get those game situations. And we, we worked how we would use our timeouts, when we would use them, what kind of punch structure we would have to get the ball and get a good return. And then we talked about what we do offensively to get ourselves in position to make that game win a field goal. So a lot of mental practice while we're out here at the same time getting the physical stuff done. But, uh, you know, it was sharp. It was intense. This is our third or fourth two a day. So you would think the guys might be dragging in the AM, but they were ready to go. So it was good practice. Well, they're motivated now because they know now that all the lifting, all the running, all the preparation they've done, it's now here. You know, to me, after that second scrimmage, you leave camp and you go to football season. You know, we, we, this is almost a bye week now before our first game. So they're motivated. They, they know that they want to, you know, polish up any last minute details, you know, things that they think they know, but they need to know they know, you know, all that type of stuff. We're answering those questions this week. It's teaching. You know, it's no different. It's, it's just like being a teacher. You know, when you go into that classroom in April and May, those kids are ready to get out. And you've got to find something that's interesting. Maybe it's a new wrinkle, something else that they haven't learned yet. Uh, maybe you throw music in the middle of practice a little bit to spice things up a little bit with the guys, to hit their playlist. Um, or, or you create game situations and these guys are competitors and they love practice and they love drills But the thing they love the most is those 12 Saturdays So anytime you can give them a game like situation where they have to play it out mentally and compete and there's a winner and a loser You make money as a coach and so we did that this morning had a great practice